Well, hey everyone, how's it going? Sean here with another Genetry Solar video. In this video, I'm going to be showing you. Um, this is an information video. Uh, the new 4,000 watt inverters that are out versus the 5,000 watt inverters. What's the difference? They look pretty much identical. So that's kind of what we're going to go over. Uh, before I do that, GenetrySolar.com, where you can find inverters like this as well as spare parts for your power jack inverters. Best way to support the channel is to buy your parts from there rather than on eBay. Uh, so PowerJack just recently introduced a 4,000 watt low frequency inverter. In fact, if uh, I actually had one sitting here or a return, I would have it side by side here to show you. But I haven't received one as a return yet. Actually, I did get one, but it was brand new. The customer just changed their mind. Uh, so I haven't received any others, but, uh, I do know the differences between the two and I can tell you it's a sticker. <laughs> That's not a joke. It, uh, it's a sticker. So if you are browsing through eBay and so on, and you see, uh, there might be a 5,000 watt inverter. There could be a 4,000 watt inverter. The two are identical. Okay. So power jack in the latest version, which would be version 9 for them, and version 10, they reduced the advertised uh, capacity of the 5,000 watt inverter down to 4,000 watts. The sticker and everything else is, is all the same. They literally just changed one number. Uh, but it is the same inverter on the inside, and I'll show you. Okay, so here's the inside of the inverter. Um, this is a version 7, so it is older, but you're going to get the idea. Uh, the transformer is identical. This is an AS2 transformer, same one they put in the 4,000 watt units. Uh, it also is a 110 volt out only and in, so you can only charge on 110. So it is not a split phase inverter. The 4,000 watts are not identical there. Still the same 12 volt fan, although they did change this with all of their inverters. The new 12 volt fans are now two wire fans and not three wire. Same main board. Uh, the MOSFETs are going to be different, but only because they did a revision during version 7 to boost the capacity of the MOSFETs, but it's the same main board. And uh, that's basically it. So you've got pretty much the same inverter. Again, PowerJack has been reducing their capacities on some of their inverters. Not all of them, but some. And that is their choice to kind of bring them more in line to what they're capable of uh, continuously. But, uh, yeah, so this inverter here, this 5,000-watt inverter, is basically identical to the 4,000-watt inverter. So if you are in the market for a new inverter and you see this 4K here, and you also see a 5K and you wonder about that. Well, uh, PowerJack isn't actually producing the 5K inverters anymore. You might still be able to find a 5K. In fact, it's very common to see resellers uh, with overstock have 5Ks still in line. But PowerJack does not make the 5K anymore. They reduced it to the 4K. So if you want the latest and greatest, the 4,000 watt inverter, that is the smallest inverter they offer that has an LCD screen. And just for those who are curious, that LCD screen, yes, it is compatible with the new LCD screens that we are going to be installing on our inverters here uh, within the next few weeks. So this can be retrofitted into an old inverter like this or a newer 5,000 watt inverter or a newer 4,000 watt inverter. Anything with an LCD screen, basically. So... Uh, stay tuned for more details on that. So there you have it. Yes, the the uh, the marketing is a little confusing, but uh, PowerJack did derate their inverters. They're identical on the inside. It's just a marketing thing. So they just brought them down to thousand watts. So uh, if you have any questions, let me know. Of course, GenetrySolar.com. And thank you for your support. And take care.